Hello, currently is the marketplace sale of June 2023 with a maximum of 50% off and here are my picks. Starting with the Pharaoh's Legacy Egyptian Temple Mega Pack by Machine Gun Studios. These are Nanite and there are more than 300 assets in this pack and uh, they also have many of their other packs on sale so you can check them out. And next is the Vintage Sci-Fi Collection. Uh, these are Static Mesh Collections. Uh, sci like alienish looks and made for Nanite I think. We got the airport security room, which is part of a bigger pack uh, of the scans matter. Uh, they are, these are really high quality asset pack. The next is mountain base by scale Y. Uh, this reminds me of uh, Star Wars and is prob probably made for third person. This one is medieval war camp nanite mega pack by hive mind. Not much to say about it. And we got the neoclassical bedroom, uh, which is an archivist pack, it looks super realistic. And next is the amusement park environment kit by Artcore Studios. They also have many other uh, items on sale. This one is very unique. And we have the abandoned classroom, uh, which has both clean, dirty and like abandoned look, which depicts Japanese classroom. And we have the abandoned house by Izumiki. I think I did a review about this, so you can check it out. Really unique uh, meshes. And then we have a special item, which is the Temple of the Sun. Uh, this is really unique and high quality, made for nanite, but I think it's mostly for third person. I don't have the pack, but probably it's not meant for first person. Up next is the Greenwood Village version 2. I don't know why many people give low rating. This is really high quality and there is interior and many, many meshes and two or three different styles of uh, buildings. Next is the sci-fi spaceship uh, base kit bash. Uh, this is made for cinematic, so be mind of that really high quality we got the post apocalyptic city uh this is inc this also includes uh, vehicles so i think drivable as well uh, this is with interior so this is really high quality uh i said mm, like mega pack could be mega pack i'm not sure uh we have the spectrum galaxy really really high quality sci-fi look We have the highway environment. I think it's a bit uh, high, high on the higher price for what it offers, but the quality of the meshes look really high. Then we have the mod modular uh, sewer system pack. Uh, this has many, many meshes, and for the price, really cheap, and the quality is really good. I might actually do a review on this because I, I do own it. Uh, on the plugin section, we got the Vertex Animation Manager. Uh, this is like more advanced version than the one that comes with the uh, as a plugin. So, um, it has many many features uh, that also supports Nanite for bone animations. Uh, this is plugin surely is on the expensive side. And then we have the component timeline, which adds uh, component uh, timeline to components, and not just in blueprints. And they should have the same. Uh, functionality is the one that comes with the blueprint and then we got the runtime vertex color and paint detection plugin really powerful plugin it has many many uses um, you, you should check it out and it has a good uh, sample project with it that demonstrates mon most of the uses and we got the ultra dynamic sky on sale this is a, if you want an easy integration of weather and stuff this is the one to go we have many reviews and still is supported gets updated Definitely a top uh, recommendation. We got the Cyber uh, Punk Ninja, which is actually one of the ones that are short showcased. Uh, it appears that I think it's uh, like inspired by Atomic Heart. Uh, it has many variations. I don't know if that's a texture or a parameter of the material. I might get it and may do a review on it. Then we have the Undead Dragon by 2D HD. Uh, it looks the quality is really good. I think I have the one of the one of their other dragon packs, and we have this uh, cool looking robot by the Instaraban, and then we have the Cyberpunk uh, Cyber Ninja. Sorry, uh, looks really high quality. 
We got the Viking uh, customization by Bookram of Maxim. Uh, the, probably it looks much better than the renders and the pictures here. Many with many customization. Then we got the horror villains pack by Sector Lab. Many horror characters, high quality. We got the Undead Alchemist by Eisen Haribel. Uh, the 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 like the detail of the measures even up close really high. Uh, they have also many other uh, items on sale. We have the evil dragon. Uh, this is probably not a dragon, but like a some simple animal, but with many uh, variations. And then we got the whale submarine, which is like a cyber not cyberpunk, but like steampunk uh, character. We got the allosaurus. Or access. I think I did a review a couple of days ago about the spino, so th the quality of this one is probably really, really high. Then we have the NMX German Shepherd. Uh, it offers many variations and stuff. Uh, really high quality if you want a high quality German Shepherd. Up next is it Safari Cyborg. Uh, it looks cool, kind of reminds me of Transformer style. Uh, I know this doesn't transform. We got the TSM character. Uh, it includes character different clothes, weapons, and a bike for $7. Then on the vehicle side, we got the Onardi and a drivable car, Plexus Games. Looks really high quality, and it says that the interior, the speedometers are also uh, rigged. How was it? Yeah, they are ready. And with the mirrors. If you want this uh, large spaceship uh, for cheap with uh, basic interior, this might be for you. Sci fi Spaceship 9. Then we got the military buggy, Scorcher. Looks like customizable buggy. And then the trailer pack, uh, which is the name suggests uh, trailer. Can kind of I probably combine it with the truck from the vehicle sample, uh, city sample vehicle. I'm not sure, and I'm not sure if that includes the, those uh, construction vehicles with it. Uh, we have the photorealistic helicopter, uh, which are two different styles with many different texture variations. I mean, do a review about it. And then there is a Soviet truck Zil pack. It looks really high quality on the outside. Uh, I'm not sure about the inside. Then the sci fi aircraft, a really high quality sci fi vehicle, uh, really cheap. Recommend it. And then on the weapon side, we got the ALX assault rifle with SFX and VFX. Uh, maybe on an expensive side, but really high quality. And then we have Unholy Modular Weapon Pack by Natoli Volovoy. I think I did a review about it. Uh, the one-handed modular weapon, so you can see the quality uh, of what he makes from the video. Probably much more high quality than the pictures. And then the Marshall, I think this is the last one, the Martial Art Weapons by Shogun uh, Games. It also includes both static and uh, skeletal mesh versions. So like I always say, these are my picks and there are many high quality assets on sale. You can check them out and find the one that suits you. Also, I mentioned it a couple of times in the video, but uh, most of these sellers also have other items on sale. You like you may find something that uh, picks your interest. And last but not least, there is also the Humble Bundle Unreal Essentials number one, uh, if I'm not mistaken which includes many many other uh, assets for for cheap really and that can be added to your epic game account so you can download it from the epic games launcher like regular assets you buy from the marketplace now also but uh, that requires uh, some steps uh, it's made by Yarawa, uh fresh can i think games by hyper and uh, one or two more uh sellers or parties that uh, that their assets are included oh yeah decagon i forgot to mention that uh 
So I, w I probably won't do a review because some of the items are repeated for, uh, from the apocalyptic previous apocalyptic pack. I already got that, so I may not get it and not do a video about it. Uh, but do check it out if you haven't got the uh, apocalyptic pack. It, it's definitely worth it for you. And that should be it. Hope you find something that you like and something that you wanted is already on sale. Have a good day.